Hey guys, it's your girl Mira and welcome back to Destination Beyond. We'll be traveling to Baltimore, Maryland. Before we even go any further, I need you to subscribe right now. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as make sure you hit that bell so that way you can get each notification every time I post something. You don't want to miss a destination. Something major is going on once I got to DC. So I actually had to go through the city of DC, which is District of Columbia, while we try to get back to the highway to get to Baltimore, Maryland. All right, so we are downtown in Baltimore and it is a whole lot going on. So hopefully we have some great things to show you today. And I have my Uber driver. It's actually not really my Uber driver. Everyone say hi to Megan. It's Uber. Hi. Megan is my best friend of over 15 years and she is joining me on this adventure. And of course, joining you guys. Baltimore Harbor and fun fact I actually used to live here for about 15 years so I'm really excited about being here and I have not been downtown for actually a really long time I've actually moved away from here about two years ago so it's been a lot of new things that they've done a lot of new things that they have going on and I'm just excited to be back and get you guys to go with me um, again if you missed earlier we got my best friend with me, who still is here, uh, Miss Megan Jules, and my god, Niecy. I'm going to have to show you guys her a little bit later, because she's getting ready to get in the car seat. But, yeah, here we are, guys. Let's go. All right, guys, so we are starting the adventure. Miss Marley is joining us, and we are going to Federal Hill first. We have never walked this, so we have no idea oh, where this is heading. You know what? That is a good question. One moment. Finally found out what's going on down here. It is draft fest for the Baltimore Ravens football team. They have been basically drafting this week, last week. Everybody came out here to show their support and their purple for their Baltimore Ravens. As we see this on, there we go. Oh, I'm blocking it.
So Bubba Gump's restaurant has actually was built, I want to say, a few years ago. But this is completely based off the movie Forrest Gump. If you haven't seen it, it is a classic and one for history that every person should see. Literally everything inside of Bubba Gump is featured about the movie. You will find everything from pictures, movie parts, even the food that you order is named after certain things that took place in the movie. So if you're a fan as far as Forrest Gump, this is where you need to go to see if you really know your knowledge. For those who have not eaten at Dick's Last Resort, I do need to tell you that it's exactly like the name. Literally. They treat you like a bunch of dicks. So I apologize for the language for those who think I'm just trying to be a pervert. No, that's what it's called, Dick's Last Resort.
July, so it has been very eventful. It was a lot of stuff going on that we were not prepared for, but actually I'm glad that it was. Um, if I missed anything, I'm sorry. For those of you who are actually from Baltimore, next time I will have more information for you guys, more detail, and more adventure. But it has definitely been an adventure for us because we walked up many hills many that we hills. were not planning on doing. Hell no! Which has proven that we are out of shape. Yes, sir. So, with that being said, today's adventure has come to a close and we are getting ready to settle down a little bit. Must have hit something. But this does not mean that it is the end. 